Hey everybody, Bray here. Um, well, I guess on to page seven of the fall of Melissa St. John. <clears throat> Back in the lunchroom after watching Melissa leave, Dantian and Furfur looked at Kaz Dea. Nice work, you moron. You almost blew it, Furfur said. Well, it's just she really has no idea why she's really here. Was it in store for her? Kazdea said. She would have if I had didn't keep kicking you, Dantalian added, smacking him on the back of the head. Relax. She didn't even notice the spectacle in which you two were engaged in. She seemed more interested in me, Lucifer said, smiling while looking at the door. <clears throat> Isn't that the whole idea, your most unholy terrorness? Kazdea said as Dan Talion was about to raise his hand to smack him again. Of course it is. I just didn't expect her to be captivated by me so soon, Lucifer said. I feel it is her yearning to belong, to be noticed at least by somebody, Furfur said. Yes, she does have that desire, doesn't she? Lucifer chuckled. Any ideas as to how to proceed next? <clears throat> Dan Talion asked. Well, I think Perespirine is probably talking about me with her as we speak, Lucifer smiled. Back in the dishwashing area, Melissa was smiling as she washed each dish and tossed in the silverware. I think you made quite the impression on Lucifer, Perespirine said. Oh, he made quite the impression on me, too. His eyes, how they sparkle, and his smile. God, his smile, Melissa gushed. Well, now, do I detect a crush, Melissa? Frostbrain smiled. Well, I suppose so. I mean, I know he's a big boss and it's wrong, but Melissa said, not here, it isn't. You're free to feel however you want to here, Frostbrain said. Well, in that case, he is quite the catch, Melissa said. Well, I should go and report your wonderful work to him. She'll I'll see you later, Presbrain said as she walked out and down back to the lunchroom. She walked inside with the most evil Cheshire-like grin. Well, Miss Frost, she's quite into you, Lucifer, Presbrain smiled. Well, I am gorgeous in every way, I suppose, Lucifer said. I think the plan is running smoothly, wouldn't you say, sir? Dantalian asked. Yes, of course. I did, just didn't expect her to react to me so soon, though. Lucifer said, Why wouldn't she, your most unholy grace? Cathay said, True. I think it's time I ask her out on a date and get the ball rolling. Lucifer said, so, all the while rubbing his chin. All three just smiled towards the door in the most devious manner. Until page eight. Oh, I hope you enjoyed page seven. See you at page eight.